Okay. Uh, which we're going to take a lot than I expected. Okay. Then we're going to want to be able to come in through the back. This vessel may not end up being my warp vessel. Then again, it might. I might just build something as large as this, you know, um, but a lot more efficient when it comes to the fuel. Okay, so we're going to start. A lot of this is going to be uh, picked up eventually. Oh, I do have ramps that I grabbed, or at least I thought I did. 99% sure I grabbed some ramps. There they are. Alright. There we go. And then these. Let's see. Actually, let's do this. This is going to be Interior. Let's just go ahead and utilize that. Put ramp on. This will probably end up being sort of angled itch. I don't know. Um. Wow, I use a lot of blocks. Okay, uh, so this area in here will be sort of the storage area, workroom area. Um, here forward, I'm going to have the cockpit area. on it working on it that's what I say. um there 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 in That. 
Like so. Okay. That you still don't have enough. Obviously. All right. I'm gonna just start gathering a whole bunch of this stuff off camera. If anything exciting happens, I'll try to come back. But uh. Yeah, I'm going to gather up as many blocks as this will hold, or as many blocks as I can. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go do that. All right, so I've run out of multi-charges. I got a good chunk of the back sort of taken off. Um, this should provide us with at least a good amount of blocks that will be useful. Go ahead and just finish off the floor area of this. Like so. Really what I want to do. Well, I want to take those off, but I can't. I guess I'll just go ahead and uh, hope I don't. There we go. Um... Hope I don't mess anything up. Um, really, I need to go find some intact or some Prometheum. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to hold off. There is another multi-tool that I have. Oh, and there's some multi-charges right there. Okay. Um, I guess I can keep at this for a while then. Um, let me just go ahead and use what I currently have, though. Um, so, well, this is going to be the bottom level of it. Are going to uh, have uh, landing gear and such, and this is probably going to be a different size ramp and such. But for now, um. What do I want to do? How do I want to do this? Let's start with cockpit area. I know I said I was going to start from the front, or I was going to start from the inside out, but I sort of went ahead and just made the exterior shape that I'm going for. Um, very front portion of it. Let's do this with the front portion of it. Let's see, let's put a forward facing of those and then actually I can do this and have this be angle forward facing one. So, okay, and then if we can extend this portion of the cockpit area at that because when I'm going to be standing here I don't need to have the glass all the way down to the ground like that but from here can start with this and then that how far back I want to make this probably no further back than that that's probably the furthest back that I want that to go that 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 we're probably gonna want it to slope least one more area of high. It'll be one, two, three, and then we'll have the ceiling on top of this portion of it. Um, that. Those 
there and there. And there we go. And that should be a good forward area. I might want to try to enclose the entire front cockpit area, but for how I would go about doing that. Let's see. I want it to slope up. That's probably not. Probably what I would want from here is actually to have it. Yep, I would definitely want to have it start. Um. See if we hit it like that, sloping forward. That I mean, I could, I could do that with. Hmm, I could do that with the windows, no problem. Um, so let's go ahead and get the whole forward area enclosed like so should have one more glass window should I not or did I not actually uh, I'll need one more glass window. I'll need one, two, three, four, at least four more glass uh, hardened windows. Now, are there any more on here? I th These are the shutter windows. We're not going to need those just yet. Uh, where are those? That's one there, 11 here. We got 12 of those. But I don't think there's any more actual glass windows on the... Oh, there are more thrusters. side probably maybe not oh there's a few okay really I should be able to do this and see if there's any more thrusters and stuff all right that's all the thrusters Okay. Can you make armored? No, you can just make the regular. That's disappointing. Um, what level am I? I love. All right, I can do that. I'm probably gonna want to learn those because I'm gonna want to spawn that to replace this. And I'll use some of these on that. Um, let's see. Small devices. Large devices. I'm not high enough level. I like can advanced constructor, but I can do a large constructor. And yep, we got enough stuff. So we'll go ahead and do that. Um... 4% power, so you should be good. Um, I'll just have to make sure to turn off the... Uh, I'll have to make sure to turn off the uh, thing when I'm done. Probably what I'll end up doing with this is I might actually put like 
nacelle type things on the side that are like close attached and uh have those be where i put uh what uh, where i put the uh rear facing thrusters and probably the down and up thrusters but i will probably also be using the gravitational thrust drives on this as well so we'll figure that out as we go um Okay, well, now that I have, I uh... oh, there's the large constructor right there. Go ahead and throw it down. Can I put it down here? Put you down here. Turn you up. Turn you off. We need to keep them off. Um, I don't have any more. Let's go ahead and make one of these switches. That'll be quick and easy. Okay. And that I am going to put... Oh... This I'm going to go ahead and put right here. This will be constructors, and we will keep the constructors to this. So uh, when I turn that on, they will start working. Um, as for this, we'll need, like I said, one, two, three, four at least if not five six seven let's go ahead and make seven and see first of all let's see if it will make seven and then uh, then we'll decide if we want it um from that, let's go ahead first. Um, from here, this part of the we need to have this. Um, that's easier. And then here, and then if I do these the way I want it to, these will actually just be solid blocks. Like so. Because that is three high and I can walk underneath it. I might make this area taller, but the cockpit area I wanted to be just three high. Okay. Now, for these portions, I'll probably end up putting devices and such in there. Um, and let's go ahead. And then this here is going to be the wall leading into... cockpit area so from here uh, we can probably do this like that 
and then we just be cross. Actually, they may go bigger, so I don't know. But I do know that this is going to be like that. And then here, say here, we're going to have the wall and then we're going to have stuff in on this wall, like a constructor and stuff on each side. And then there's going to be a door in the middle there. Let's go ahead and get the door. And I do. Want it to be one of these so there we go and i'll probably put a little sensor on the side i don't have a whole lot of these to use right now but i can go ahead and that oh i don't have a core right now um i'll put the core down when i put the core down i will do that. I'll put that on. I might put the core over here somewhere. Okay. Um. Did make any of the windows I wanted it to? Ah. Did I tell it to make one of those by mistake? All right, well, it looks like we need titanium plates. That's easy. Okay, maybe not so easy. We get some titanium plates from these. Okay. It uses three titanium plates each. So if I do seven, that's going to be 21 titanium plates that we need. We have 12. Let's just go ahead and continue. We have 24, so we should be able to make the windows that I need. Okay. That should cover the interior. Um, probably what I'll end up doing is using this cockpit for this ship. Um, all right, let's see what we have. We have refrigerators. See, let's put one of each of those on each side. We'll do that. What I'll probably end up doing is input output or input output Pro yeah probably input output and then the two on the sides down there are going to be extra storage um on this other side here um i will probably just want really what i'm going to want is a container controller above and below it so um can you make the container controllers? Yes. Alright, so that can make those. Did it make all seven? It did? Okay. Let's get this cockpit finished. 
and then I will continue gathering uh, I will continue gathering from the ship off camera right and that should go there and these what I want is this go here and this go there and then this will go there all right now and rotate we want all the dark ones to be light in here that so we can look out and see out just fine okay very nice very nice and then in here we're probably gonna have some uh like we might have like the gear and stuff in here armor locker and such i don't know um i may end up putting the core up in here but i may not i don't know i may end up extending this further back like make this area be the engineering area then put like a whole hangar bay area in the back for my uh, scout so that even if I'm if, if I have a capital vessel I can put my scout back there and go like I and use this as a uh, mobile base okay I think that everything I need right now oh let me go ahead and put these down so what I'm going to want is this will be the output, this will be the input. Okay. there I might put another box there but so we'll have the input and the output I might actually just make this entire wall a constructor thing um, this wall I don't know what I'm gonna do it may just end up being storage with uh, container controllers and such like that but I don't know okay I can't control that or anything. Okay. Um, let's go ahead. I'm going to start gathering more blocks. Since I do have uh, more charges now. And uh, I'll be back when I'm done.